Hello, Nomad Sculpt. This video is about off-center sculpting and use the view cube in the correct orientation for the object you're working on. So here in Nomad Sculpt, um, the this this object here is in the world center, and this objects here are off center. And yeah, sorry, um, I work with version 177, but this should also work with version 176. Okay, so when you want here your object in the correct, correct view, uh, in the front view, and you press here and at the right side on the view cube, on the front, then this happens. Um, it's not in the correct front view because the front view is, is this for the object. But it's not possible in Nomad Sculpt to use the, the correct views for off-center objects um, or objects in the space like this. Um, okay, and how to, uh, to do it, to use the correct views? Um, your box is now selected here in the hierarchy and select the gizmo for this uh, object here and when you add now a group node uh, make sure that um, this on gizmo um, option is active and it works only if the gizmo is selected here um, and then press add group here group and now select the whole group and create an instance of this group here instance button at the top okay and the next step is very important we are now at the moment in a mirror node here so when you're in inside a group node or mirror node or something always put this instanced group here out of the node make it make sure that it's uh, not inside a group or inside a repeater um, yeah it have to be a single object in the hierarchy so now use the, the gizmo settings here and press here move origin and make sure that your group and your box is selected so move origin and now we use the solo view and reset the view so you see now this object is now in the world center but not in the correct orientation so now select only the group node only the group node and reset the group node and now the correct uh, now you have correct views for this object so when you press now uh, on top view or right view so the views are correct and now when you use here your object uh, or select your object and you trim something here i use the line tool a line is okay trim so let's trim here something so And let's see now the other object free in space the the trims are correct and the correct view like this here and yeah so you can work on this object with a correct orientation of the views and here always use then the solo view and here you can now make your changes 
and this group here you can um, hide later or you can delete it so when you want to see now um, this object here sorry where i am here this is what the correct object so yeah okay that's it have fun with sculpting ciao